Hello, Triple G Gamer here again with a special reaction video. This was a request music video uh, to go. Somebody requested me to go check out this guy, uh, Nick Natoli, or Nick, or Nick New, uh, Natoli, uh, Um, not sure you pronounce that. I think it's Nick. It's Nick Notali, or. No, I think it's Nick Notelli. Anyway, this guy. Um, sorry if I totally mispronounced the name. I, I probably did. I might have gotten it right. But anyway, um, thank you. Shout out to the person who reacted, who, who did this. Um, actually, hold on, wait. Let me actually pull up the name. Shout out to uh, let me see. Here. Now. There's someone by the name of Nell Nevis. Check out Suit Up or I Wonder by Nick Notelli. Okay? So, shout out to you, um, Nell Nevis. And, wow. Uh, well, this one's going to be slightly a different reaction video because, actually, they're short. So, I'm going to include both of them all into one reaction video. Same artist, two different songs. That's why it's special. I'm going to react to both his songs. Um, I've already listened to both of them. And... You know, I automatically, the, the first song I heard was I Wonder. I listened to that one, and I listened to Suit Up. Um, yeah, that uh, one with the dad shorts, dad wears short short shorts to a point. That one's freaking hilarious. Go check out that video if, if you want to laugh. Anyway, I'm off topic. Anyway, um, we're going to listen to Suit Up and then I Wonder. And I heard I Wonder first, and okay, I automatically... Um, because of what he said in the video, in that specific music video, I automatically got mass respect for this guy. And, well, you'll figure out why when I react to it. But anyway, let's get this started. This is Nick Notali, or Natoli, Suit Up, official music video. Trippy, legit gamer here doing a reaction video. So anyway, smack that like button, subscribe. Hope you guys do enjoy it. Comment below. Sh feel free to share my videos. And I also do video gameplay walkthroughs and things. Grand Theft Auto is coming. Don't worry. It's just, yeah. Um, I got a few more Tom McDonald reaction videos to also do. Those are coming as well. But let's get into it. This is Nick Notali, Suit Up, official music video first. Triple H Gamer here doing the reaction video. So, enjoy. Okay, first off, right off the bat, um, I actually like it. He's kind of like rainbow with freaky colors, kind of like tie-dye with electronic art, you know, like um, like a rap party effect, you know, that I think that's freaking hilarious. And I will say that I do like this guy's flow. I really do. I like this guy's flow. And he's freaking, the way he does it, I don't know if he's doing it intentionally, but I find him freaking hilarious at times, too. And I've only heard two of his songs so far, and I'm like, wow. I mean, he's not like hardcore like Tom McDonald, you know, how he delivers it, or Eminem, you know, but he's still good. And, you know, one day, he if this guy keeps it up, in my opinion, I think he's actually going to get somewhere in life. So anyway, yeah, uh, Nick Notoli, this video, Suit Up, official music video, six days ago, already 108,000 views. Wow. That is pretty damn good. In my opinion. Seriously. Over a hundred thousand views already. Anyway. Yeah. Oh. I love the beat. Yeah. I love the beat. Uh, ain't nothing like the feeling of a new song. Every one I write, I dedicate to who I prove wrong. Laugh in their motherfucking faces, nigga, who won? Cause they used to sleep on me like their favorite futon. 
ain't it, ain't it funny how are you on? Everybody wanna come around like a new son. Ask for some money and advice like my new son. Saying they was down for a sacrifice, new blood. Act like they was all black man when they Ku Klux. Act like they was down back then, they gave two fucks. They used to want it all till a motherfucker grew up. This industry is really black and white. Don't you show up, show up. Shoot up. Shoot up. This industry is really black and white. Don't you show up. Okay, wow. Okay, first off, I really love this guy's flow. I actually do love this song, Suit Up. Um, I love how it kind of switches back and forth, and then it kind of went into, like, almost, like, black and white there for a second. And, you know, the lighting, I mean, people might watch this, and they might have seizures, so just a warning. I mean, there are actual people with that, you know, the lighting, and they cause a seizure, so I'm just warning you. Actually, I should have mentioned that earlier on, but... Um, I'll put that in the description. Warning, you m possible seizure warning. Just saying. Um, I'm gonna actually put that in the description. So yeah, and possibly the title. So yeah, wow. Um, this guy's flow is really good, and I can actually understand every single word. Thank God he's not a mumble rapper. Oh God, it's like what the heck did you just say? I no, and no, I do not like Post Malone either. Just saying. No, thank you. This, this guy's just... I really like his second song that I'm going to react to even better. It's just... What he said in there, in, in the second video, the second song... Uh, the... I wonder... Holy crap. What he said in there, I got mad respect for him, okay? And you're going to see why. This, yeah, like I said, this guy's flow is just, it's pretty freaking good. And you know what? I feel like this guy's going to make it big one day. I seriously do. I really do think that if, guy, if Nick keeps doing what he's doing, he's going to make it big. I just got to say that. <laughs> I love the beat. <laughs> that was just... That was just hilarious right here. Genius voice changing. Coming up the stage, take your motherfucking hype gone. Nick the Tony, yeah, you know the motherfucking hype strong. Bullets in the track. You don't wanna catch a live one. Cause all of my enemies give a fuck about bygones. Claiming they're your greatest favorite rapper like they bag on. This crack cocaine music, nigga. I high long. Produce a track and I wrote the right song. I'm okay, wow, that, okay, he just, okay, he just beautifully triggered me. It, well, in a sense, in a, in a good way, man. He just reminded me of the song by Biggie Small, Ten Crack Commandments. Rule number uno. The Ten Crack Commandments. So you go check out that song. That's old school stuff. He just reminded me of that. Okay, yeah. Even more mass respect for that. Damn. Damn. Suit up. Okay, first off, prison is not fun, people. Please be pro social. Don't be anti social. Okay, do not go against society. Just please. Um, in any illegal way, says so we get it very frowned upon. I'm just saying, prison is not fun, people. Prison, believe me when I say, hands down, 100%, prison is not fun. I just got to say that. Okay? Yeah, prison's not fun. Shoot up, shoot up. 
Okay. I get what he's saying here. He's saying because it's so black and white, we should add more color to it. So suit up. That's what he's saying here. You know what? Wow. I like it. I I like what he's saying there. And that's what he's saying. In my opinion, that that's what he's saying there. I mean, not that there's wrong with just black and white people, you know, but um, this earth is very diversified. America is very diversified. I don't know if he's American or not. He might be Canadian. I don't know. But in America, we're very diversified and we should just accept it. That's what I got out of that. That's what he's saying. So we should suit up. We should be more colorful and more uh, colorful. You know, and just accept people more. Of course, we can have disagreements and stuff, but that's, that's what I got out of that. That's what I'm getting out of this song, you know? Seriously. And you know what? That, in my opinion, from because I got out of that, got what I just said out of this song, that is a very wonderful, this is a very wonderful song. It's, actually, the flow is pretty freaking phenomenal. I mean, this guy's got mass potential, so keep it up, Nick. Uh, no, Tolly or Natali. I cannot, I cannot miss, I cannot pronounce his last name. Um, but yeah. Um, like I said before, 108,000 views as of less than a week. That, to me, that's pretty freaking good. I mean, that's a lot better than I'm doing. <laughs> um, but yeah, seriously. That's what I got out of it. That's what I got out of it. Damn. Okay. Now. The next song is I Wonder by Nick. Official. No. We're going to go to back. The official music video. Nick Notoli. Natali. I Wonder. Official music video. And this this is where I got math respect for him. And I've only heard a, and I've only heard two songs by him. Yeah, like I said, go check out that video, freaking hilarious! If you want to laugh, um, yeah, that's what it is. Dad wears short shorts to prove a point to his teen daughter. Freaking hilarious! Um, if you want to laugh, go check out that video. Anyway, this is into the next song. Nick Notoli, I wonder, official music video reaction done by me, Triple Legit Game here. Anyway, I. Also, I hope you guys liked the video, so smack that like button, subscribe. I also do video game footage. I got more video game footage coming up. Um, I'm almost done with Tom McDonald as well. And you know what, people, thank you for watching. Anyway, let's get into this one, because this one, oh my gosh. Like I said before, this, I hear this one, I got mass respect for this guy. You're, and you're going to see why. Anyway, yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> One day ago, wait, right? Yeah. One day ago, 116,000 views already in one day. Wow. I like it. You know what? Let's just back up a little bit. Oh, wait. What's his shirt say? Oh, okay. I wonder why Tupac had to get shot. One of the greatest rappers alive, but it was more that we lost. A conscious that right there. That's because I. That's why I have mass respect for this guy. Holy crap, man! He just referenced one of the gods of rap, Tupac, who was taken way too soon from us. And yes, people, end of discussion. He's dead. He ain't coming back. He did not fake his death. I wish he had. But no, his mother is dead. Tupac's mom is dead. The only thing, if he was, if he was never planning on coming out of hiding. The only thing that would bring him out of hiding is his mother's death. He would have shown up at her funeral, her wake, whatnot. He would have shown up. And he truly would have been spotted, okay? He wasn't. Tupac is dead, and you know, it, it's sad. But, Nick, because of that, I have mass respect for you, man. I have, hands down, 100 miles and running, I have mass respect for you, man. Because of that line. 
And I'm going to rewind it because that is just beautiful. Hands down, mass respect, man. I wonder why Tupac had to get shot. One of the greatest rappers alive, but it was more that we lost. Mass respect. On the verge of creating a spark. So now we hating just to hate like racism in the dark. I wonder if Lenin... Never caught those bullets of the government would ever let him live his life to the fullest. I wonder if Martin ever felt like a king, or do we rob him of that like separating angels from wings? I wonder if Whitney Houston sang one last tune. I wonder why the greatest artists always die too soon. I wonder if Kurt caught one in the head, cause Courtney Love was just too much, he'd rather end it instead. I wonder why. We never value their worth. I wonder why Mike Jack had blood on his shirt. I wonder why Kanye minister in my church. I wonder why 27 is the mark of a curse. I wonder why. Okay, what does he mean by that? Because many artists who are up and striving, who are famous, you know, especially in rap, you know, um, they don't really live past 30. Okay? Tupac, Biggie, uh, what's that other guy's name? So, uh, uh, guy of Cornrows, uh, X something. Um, he died a few years ago. Um, and some other guy, uh, not Exhibit, but the other guy. It was a few years ago and stuff. He kind of died similar to the way Tupac was. He was gunned down in his car. But I think he was the one driving now. And he was gunned down. But Tupac was in the passenger seat. Um, him, you know. And it's sad. Seriously, this shit needs to stop. And you know what? Tupac and Biggie's murders are solved. Technically. I might actually do a video on that. Actually, shout out FYI. Um, I have like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine pages explaining what happened to Tupac and Biggie and who actually killed them and who ordered the hits, okay? So you know what? Let me know in the comments below if you guys want me to make a video about that, okay? Because I will. Because I've tried it a couple of times and it just went to poop. But I will actually work on making a video. If you guys want to see uh, see me talk about Tupac and Biggie's murder. Anyway, that's why I have mass respect for this guy now. Because he mentioned a Tupac. And look, the fact is he's dead. Okay? He's dead. Why? Too soon. I wonder if Kurt... Caught one in the head, cause Courtney Love was just too much, he'd rather end it instead. I wonder why we never value that word. I wonder why Red Mike Jack had blood on his shirt. I wonder why Kanye minister in my church. I wonder why 27 is the mark of a curse. I wonder why. I wonder why. Okay, I love the digital facial expressions on his mask thing he's wearing. I love the message of this song, but that part, you know... I, it's freaking funny. I like it, man. Good job, man. I, I like the lighting. And, yeah. Like I said before, the, uh, if you have photosensitivity, you know, that's what I'm talking about, too. So, yeah. Mass respect to this guy, man. It just, this song is ten times better than the last one, though. In my opinion, this is more of my favorite song. I wonder. I wonder why. Tupac. Kurt Cobain, John Lennon, you know. I love the message of this song. I really do. Seven is the mark of a curse. I wonder why. Oh, damn, he mentioned Bob Marley. Holy crap, I love Bob Marley. Rasta, the king of Rasta music. Holy crap, I love it. every single one of the Marleys, uh, the family of all the Marleys music, okay? Especially Bob Marley, man.
Holy crap, man. Even more mass respect, man. Even more mass respect. Keep it up. I wonder if Marley put one last joint in the air. I wonder why Prince didn't just take the stairs. I wonder why Robin Williams is dead. The funniest man alive was just unhappy, I guess. I wonder if Hugh Hefner is getting bitches in. Okay, wow. Um, look, Michael Jackson, Robin Williams, you know, great entertainers. Robin Williams, freaking hilarious dude. I loved him in uh, freaking Cash Adams, the Doctor movie. I loved him in the uh, movie series uh, Night at the Museum, you know, where he played Teddy Roosevelt. Hey, but look, Michael Jackson and... Well, the thing with Michael Jackson is that Michael Jackson didn't have any childhood, okay? He didn't have a childhood, and he was a tortured soul. Okay, His soul was tortured. He was a tortured soul on earth. Okay? Same thing with Robin Williams. He was a tortured soul. Great entertainer. Really funny. I love a lot of Michael Jackson's songs like Black and White, Thriller. Uh, and then when that song came out, um, the only thing to beat Thriller was uh, Peter Frampton. And the song that he released at the, like right after or around the same, or yeah, shortly after Thriller. He was the only one to beat because he was taking the charts with Thriller. And Peter Frampton released a song. Uh, go go look it up. The song that beat uh, Michael Jackson's Thriller. It's by Peter Frampton, okay? That's good music too, okay? But yeah, great entertainer. And look, they were tortured souls. That's just the truth. They were tortured souls on earth. And it's sad. Yes. But... It is what it is. It's still sad, but I appreciate this guy mentioning them, especially Tupac. So, you know what? Rest in peace, Tupac and Biggie. Love you guys. Wonder why they call you a bitch. Ten crack from Hammets. Juicy. Hit them up. Out on bail. You know, I'm a soldier. Biggie, Tupac, man. Mass respect, man. Mass, mass respect, Nick. Love it. Prince didn't just take the stairs. I wonder why Robin Williams is dead. The funniest man alive was just unhappy, I guess. I wonder if Hugh Hefner is getting bitches in heaven. I wonder if Elvis is really playing chess with the devil. I wonder if we're really gonna see our own Armageddon. I wonder what really happened in New York 9-11. 3,000 that was lost, but the whole world was affected. I wonder if as a people we could just stop this regression. I wonder if instead of guns we could shoot love and affection. I wonder if the song will ever reach someone and affect them. I wonder. I love the message. I love the message of this song. I love the ending with the mask, the crying, and the blood. I really do. I love that. Wow. So that was Nick Notoli. I wonder. And Nick Notoli suit up. Two really great songs. I love it. I love the second one. Wow. More than the first one. I mean, still two, two really great songs. Stuff, but my own personal opinion. I wonder by Nick Notoli. Um, wow, that song had more effect on me when I first heard it. In fact, he actually, I listened to it twice before I actually did the music video, and he did The Impossible for me with my autism stuff. Tom, he's more than once also done The Impossible for me. See, I'm autistic, and I have a hard time expressing my feelings. But, yeah, the first time I actually heard the I Wonder Why, I actually cried a little bit. I got emotional. So, Nick, to me... The Triple G Gamer here, congratulations, you did the impossible for me. Um, you made me cry, so congratulations. That's actually a good thing. 
I'm proud of that. So shout out to you, man. And also because of that, I even have more mass respect for you, man. Nick, keep it up. People, I hope you guys enjoyed this special reaction video. Um, and thank you so much. Shout out again to the person who suggested I do this song. Thank you to do this reaction video of the, these two songs and stuff. I decided to combine them because they were so short. Song stuff, but the message in the second one was, even though it was a short song, it's just so powerful. I wonder why. Exactly. Just point proven. I wonder why. So people, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Smack that like button. Subscribe if you haven't. Feel free to share my videos on your social media account by web links. Anything much appreciated if you guys do that. I also do video game footage. And don't worry. Grand Theft Auto is coming. I just had to do that special reaction video stuff. And I'm finishing up Tom McDonald's and stuff after when I'm done with that. Um, I will probably have had done every single music, every single reaction video of mine on Tom McDonald's. Every single video he has on his YouTube channel. I will have had done that and i will continue keep and i will keep doing tom mcdonald reaction videos to people so i hope you guys enjoyed it anyway i'm out and thank you so much for watching i got more videos coming up so don't worry